Jill with Angel Creations. Welcome back to my craft room. We have a Tuesday tree haul to do today. So things are kind of winding down in the, you know, um, well, Christmas is coming out. So everything else is kind of winding down and the store is filling up with Christmas things. But I was able to find a few more fall um, you know, harvest, Halloween things that I had been looking for. So I'm excited to show you what I found. First, we'll go to the um, fall-ish stuff. I had been looking for this specific piece. It is just one of those hollow, um, you know, picture frame box frame things that the Dollar Tree loves to come out with every year and I've been finding them in apple pie and pecan pie and different things but I definitely wanted this to do a craft with. So it's the pumpkin pie recipe and um, I just have wanted to do a craft with this but it had to be the pumpkin pie and I'm so glad that I found it finally so yes I picked that up really happy to find that I didn't think I was going to because I figured all the ones that I had been finding weren't pumpkins so I figured well pumpkin must have gone fast it must have gone first and so Anyway, then I have been decorating for fall. Uh, well, I had to take everything down for the hurricane, but seeing that I'm putting it all back up again, I felt like I needed to uh, add a few more of the foliage. Um, I got two colors just because there's just it could just use a few more so um yeah so since i'm putting it all back up again i'll add another two strands these are pretty i'm not sure if they're even worth a dollar 25 they're pretty light they're pretty thin i mean look at all that they are pretty thin so i what I do is I buy the different colors and there's even another one that's more yellow and green. And then I just take the three and kind of wind them together. So I'm just going to use these as fillers for the ones that I already do have uh, outside. I'm going to fill her in. And then I picked up one of these. Now these are really good to have. I have, I might be able to show you right here. I cut these apart is what, a lot of times is what I do. If I don't turn it over and use this as like a shiplap or something, um, I like to take these and just cut them apart. And you can add these pieces to like a um, wreath or anything. So look, here is one that was on the top and we know that because it has the jute hanger. Oops says autumn and another one that I had that says give thanks but then these are all the ones that I cut off so you can just stick this in your wreath or there's so many things it's so versatile so I like to pick those up every once in a while just for that purpose so that I can cut them all up I mean look at this um, Hot apple cider. Can you see? I don't want to glare. They're just awesome little pieces to have, and they're already printed for us. And as a matter of fact, I should do a craft with these. I think we will do a craft with one of these. Um, haven't done that in a long time. But anyways, this one says rest your bones, tombstones, cobwebs, haunted house, beware, dead end, and keep out. So those are really versatile signs, like I said, to either cut apart and we would get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven pieces for $1.25, that's seven crafts. And I just noticed that this little guy is, can you see him? He's like 3D, he's got a little, he's round, he's got a little round belly there or back. So that's pretty good pretty good and I hadn't seen that one yet so <clears throat> all right 
boring is the co-workers need some more cookies so pick them up some of their favorite if i ever do a trivia uh thing and ask you know like i might do some kind of contest for a winning thing this will definitely be one of the questions so remember this is what are my cat's favorite flavor of treats actually cookies we call them and that is milk they like the milk that's their favorite but they don't ever turn up their nose to one <laughs> and then I have a box going out to my grandson here and uh, well actually to my daughter but I'm I've thrown mostly a whole bunch of stuff in it from my grandson since the box is going and I just picked him up some sour candy. I know he loves it. And um, so I'll stick that right in his box right now. All right, I got a couple more exciting things. Um, so this is a really nice little set of hair clips. You get four of them and they're little claw clips and they're really nice ones. Um, really nice. You can tell they're nicely made. These two have like a, almost a velvety, uh, not really, but like, not velvet, but they're different texture. And then these are shiny and slippery, but these are not. And I loved the colors, so I need to do both sides. So I had to pick up two, so I will have two of each. But really pretty, can you see? Um, I wish I could tell you what this feels like. I don't know. Almost a silicone, but not, but it's harder than silicone. But um, they had these in a whole bunch of different colors. And these are the two that I, well, this is the one that I chose. And I'm really excited about those. I think those would be cute. I, I can't, I don't know. These are Dollar Tree clips too, but anyhow all right i picked up one of these again i needed this we're gonna do a do i have it handy we're gonna do a craft um maybe tomorrow tomorrow is wednesday don't hold me to that um but it's in my agenda my planner to do a craft with these and i i had i picked up one to go with the three I already had and it's a bad one so I needed to replace it so I picked up another one and what I should have done was brought my bad one back Jackie would have taken that back any Dollar Tree will take back anything that's damaged you can't get your money back but they will give you another one or a store credit I found these these came out in home or love and they are adorable just as they are it's the MDF wood here um, and of course this is adorable just as it is but of course we are going to um, totally change this but that is really cute isn't that really cute I mean the color I can't I don't know the color doesn't really go but um, it's really cute very pretty flower though so keep your eyes open for us doing a craft with that and then I picked up this for no other reason than all I see is Christmas on here of course you have to flip it over to see Christmas but look at that nice little hanger on the back Dollar Tree is really doing it up I mean this is not my taste for decor but if it if it was that's perfect it says dreaming it's got the uh, marble color and the wood grain and then the really nice hanger on the back that's a great hanger to take off. We will be taking that off because we will most likely be using this side. So I will take that off and put that in my little jar of little hanger thingies. And we'll probably take Dreaming off too. It's a little galvanized metal uh, piece that's probably glued on and uh, we can get that right off with a glue gun. I mean, a, a heat gun, heat tool. And by the way, this heat tool is always in the description of every video I do. If you would like to ever purchase one of those, um, I don't sell them, but Amazon does. And I put a link in there. I 
coffee. I didn't bring my coffee down. I know I did. Here we go. I need a sip of my coffee. Sorry. Wet my whistle. But, um... If you ever want that little heat gun, it's an amazing tool. It takes these stickers off like that. So, it's always down in my description box. I think it's like 12 or $13. And lastly, I picked up two of these removable tile decals. Yeah, we don't have a glare. In this beautiful blue color. And I do have a craft trying to get it so that it, you can see the color but that it's not glaring but it's a beautiful blue it's almost a winter blue um it's anyways i have a craft in mind to do for this for the winter you know what i mean so these won't you won't see these again for a little while but look at how pretty that color is i'm trying to Get that gorgeous color so that'll do it for our dollar tree uh tuesday tree haul today and um so yeah the stores are starting to fall into a little low with one season but they are really um really hyping i mean not hyping but um what's the word i want but they're really coming in full fledged now with all the christmas so if there is anything that you wanted last year uh as far as crafts or ornaments or anything uh you need to be going almost daily right now to see if you can get your hands on that now because those same things are going to fly out of the dollar tree again this year and it seems like other than maybe two things it seems like all the ornaments that i've seen so far are exactly the same as last year pretty close anyway um so but i did see a couple of new things and um yeah and i want to find one of the reindeer you know the mdf reindeer or moose i don't remember what it was it had antlers and i'm um, looking for one of those so i want to get my hands on one of those this year um but anyway it's already out so like i said get there early and get what you need before it's all gone um and this is a great time to give me a thumbs up and make sure you subscribe that really helps my channel grow immensely immensely appreciated and until we see each other again be good and do good bye now